It is Thursday, March the 22nd, 2018. It's an honor to be testing out a new bullet called the Sledgehammer from Hammer Bullets. Steve Davis, uh, who is one of the co-owners, got a hold of me sometime towards the end of January and was really interested in me shooting um, a hog with these sledgehammers. He sent me actually three different bullets, but uh, the property I'm going to be hunting tonight is getting absolutely pummeled with hogs. So hopefully I'll get on one and uh, we'll see how these sledgehammers do and uh, we'll do a neocropsy probably in another video since uh, there's so much weirdness going on on YouTube right now. But stay tuned and we'll try to kill us a pig tonight. As soon as I entered the property I could hear the hogs rustling through the creek. I spotted a few of them and turned on the hog collar to see if I could draw them closer but with no luck. My gut instinct told me that they would probably follow the creek to our adjacent property. The issue was is that that's 600 yards away. I started running to cut them off. The wind was gusting in my face, so I wasn't worried that they would hear me. When I got into position, I could hear them coming. I kicked on my thermal, and there they were. I moved to the top of the pond dam, and this is what happened. You have got to be kidding me. Look at the size of the sounder. In the next 10 minutes, I watched this massive sounder slowly foraging, but at the same time looking for one clear lane. Thermals are horrible at not being able to see twigs and limbs. Down to the last hog, I just needed it to walk into the right lane, and we'll pick up the action from here. The hammer is down. Let's finish them off. Oh, look at this shot placement. Man, sledgehammer laid down the wall. You guys don't understand the distance that I shot this hog. I didn't even under realize the distance. This is easily a 225 yard shot on a hog. And this is a nice saddle. After returning, checking on the sow that I shot, I heard a hog growl. I turned on my thermal to see her less than 30 yards away. I hit this third hog, but felt my bolt lock back as she ran away. I literally don't have any bullets. <laughs> this is the first hog shot last night. Here is the entry right here. And the exit is right behind the neck at 225 yards. And it was still kicking a little bit, so I did a follow-up shot right behind the head here. This other hog was basically no less than 25, 30 yards right in front of me with that entire sounder. The entrance wound was right here in the chest. Listen to that, that shoulder was completely destroyed. Look at the arm. And then um, it exits right below the abdomen here. So we're gonna do a neocropsy in my next video, so stay tuned for that. Does anyone want a Weimaraner? The first sow taped in at over 35 inches, weighing 150 pounds. The second sow taped in at just over 30 inches, weighing 100 pounds. The sledgehammer bullet performed exactly as Steve Davis said they would. The next video I will do a neocropsy and show you the terminal performance at hog shot at both 225 yards and at 20 yards. And maybe next time I will load more bullets. Stay tuned for my next adventure.